friends welcome to my channel civil 3d pro designer today i have a question from my facebook page member that how can we import google earth road center line into autocad civil 3d so for that we need three software autocad civil 3d global mapper and google earth before starting kindly subscribe my youtube channel civil 3d pro designer and you can also access me through my facebook page civil 3d pro designer here you will get many more materials and videos about autocad civil 3d and lens surveying so let's start our lesson that how can we import Road center line from Google Earth to AutoCAD Civil 3D. First of all, you need to open your Google Earth Pro. You can download it from the Google it is totally free and you can also download global mapper it's free if you have not autocad civil 3d you can get them from get into pc.com there will be a full package which you can download when you will open your google earth first of all go there in tools and options 3d view you must need to select universal traverse marketer and if you are working in meters you need to select in meters but i am now working in feet so i will select feet click apply and then okay you must need to go for a location you can search and you can zoom in and out for example i can go like that any location you can search i am finding a random location as you can see we have a location and there are some roads lots and houses everything you know it's a very important and high paid skill if you can import any land data from google earth to autocad later you can play with them in autocad civil 3d it's trending nowadays in usa market UK and Australia mostly uh, the U USA clients come to you and ask for that use Google Earth to get them for data so if you know it's very high pad it's very high pad uh, skill but if you don't know this is video for you please don't skip that and follow my each step as you know we have roads and land for example i want to pick this area into autocad civil 3d select here add path First of all, select this temporary base and then click on add path. Give a name. I am collecting the road. So it, you can select road. When you will zoom in and out, you must need to uh, care about your tilt. Press shift 
and go like that okay it will reset your tilt if your tilt is disturbed it will make difference between actual and your observation so for example i want to collect the data i want to collect the center line of this road which you can see here i will place a point here another point if road is straight you can put just two point but if it is not it will you can put more than one point or two points so the one line here and another line we have i want to put this it's our corner and uh, we also want this you can put some points on it will approximately but if your client have a pdf file from the city then you can adjust the area for lot according to them but it will use it can be used for preliminary designs and conceptual design for your lots it will same apply for the boundary lines of any lot any house any parking area which you can import into autocad civil 3d also once we have center line of the road like that you can click ok and now you can see we have a file road so here our work on google earth is finished just click on the right right click and save to my places uh, sorry you need to save save place as and it will ask for a path and you can select a type of file it will kmz or camel you need to select kmz and then select save now we have a file kmz you need to open global mapper actually the global mapper is a like a bridge for us between google earth and autocad civil 3d it will convert the kmz file to our drawing file or if you are uh, working for contours then it will convert your kmz file into csv files text file for the elevation data like x y z to import them in autocad civil 3d later i will uh, make a video for you on contours plan that how can we uh, import contours from google earth to autocad civil 3d if you are interested please write down in the comment box i will make a video for you and you will open global mapper forget all other options just uh, if you are looking open data files click on that if you are not looking this option please click file and then open data you need to found your kmz file which you have already get from the google earth select sorry it's not working i need to check wow what is happening ah we have we need to save a road before i was save temporary places but i need to save roads and save place as road put the name road 
save then open your road here okay it is our road so you need to remember your points which was your center line it was the center of line of this road and these points on another road and it will another so in this corner you will ignore them later once you open your file in global mapper go into the tools and select configure here you will see many option for your projections here will be projections and you need to select UTM universal traverse market because it was same in Google Earth so you need to use same system for your coordinates and if you are using meters you need to select meter but it was currently in feet so you need to select feet feet international i am selecting then apply and okay you can see a little bit difference again going to the file download online imagery imagery top or terrain maps it will connect you don't need to edit anything here just click connect it will get you online imagery data for your trying for your roads it will actually again select files and export you will see here export vector lighter format you can see a many option from here but for the now i am going with export vector lighter data it is saying you want to select xyz file into text file no i want to uh, get dwg format text file we use normally for continuous data which we can import them later in AutoCAD Civil 3D but for the now I need DWG trying press OK OK and uh, I think you don't need to uh, select here any other options just click OK and it will save you a drawing with your names okay save it's saved already close your global mapper and you can also close uh, your drawing your google earth but uh, it can be held with drawing so little bit uh, you need to open open your civil 3d and open the drawing which you have already you get from global mapper we will locate our drawing here we have road open continue opening drawing file and you will see here we have our lines for center line of the road if you can't see you need to press z enter and e enter or you can press twice your mouse v so here you have your road center line if you want to import your any boundary for your house your lot your lanes boundary you can import same like that so how i will uh, play with that first of all you need to select pl and then select line here it was our first road center line and another center line of the road was here and the third one was 
this so you can delete this one and now you have three simple lines of different three rows if it is same you can extend them to each one and get your center line of the road and inside you have your land hope you like this video for these type of tricky videos and if you have any trouble shoot in autocad civil 3d google ads and global mapper you can also contact me through my facebook page and you can write down in comment box for any question hope you like this video thank you goodbye